Yo, what's up guys? How's it going? Welcome back to another FIFA 19 video. I'm Rob the Wolf and well, I want to start off by apologizing for not uploading yesterday. These are the SPC players that were released yesterday. Honestly, none of them really interest me. So that is why I didn't push myself into doing the video yesterday, but I do want to apologize for not uploading. I woke up with a mean hangover. I I was just up all night. I was up all night. I was celebrating Club America's League of Mix title win. And I don't know. I just, I, I was going to record it. I just, I, I couldn't find the strength to even get into the game or anything like that. I did get into the game and take screenshots of this these players just so I could talk about them later on but I'm just gonna do it now I'm gonna do it now I'm gonna show you guys my thoughts on these players I have a couple minutes to talk about them first off there's an Andres Iniesta 88 rated I believe you needed an 84 rated team for this Andres Iniesta but it didn't really interest me even though I like Andres Iniesta and I like uh, I'm a Barcelona fan it didn't really interest me because of the stamina that they put on him he has 55 stamina he's his physical overall is 58 which is a horrible terrible just he's not he's not fast he won't last very long I mean maybe if I put him in second half like the last 30 minutes or so his passing is really good his vision is amazing. Ball control, reactions, dribbling is good. Composure is good. If anything, I would do it just to collect the card. But it didn't really interest me. Mario Balotelli, another player that just didn't really interest me. He has really good shooting. But there's no players or no team that I could fit him into. So he just wouldn't, he, he wouldn't fit my squad. If there's a player that fits my team, like Firmino, like I was gonna do Firmino, but Firmino going at about a hundred thousand, I thought it was a reasonable price. I just, I couldn't like. There was no. I feel like there's gonna be better players and better cards out there than those than the cards that are that have been coming out. Now, 77 acceleration is a bit on the downside, but sprint speed is good. Finishing, attack positioning is nice. Shot power and long shots are good. Penalties, irrelevant, but he has good penalties. So if you ever need a penalty kick taker, he's, he could be your guy. Free kick accuracy and short passing, it's nice. Long passing sucks, so if you're going to use him as a cam, you're better off short passing. Now I have six minutes. I still have enough time. Strength is nice. Stamina is still low on this card. He, If he's going to be a starter, only possibly you're going to have to take him out first half. I mean, uh, at halftime or within the first 60 minutes. Uh, what else? He's a four-star weak foot, four-star skill move. That's that's about it for for Balotelli. I liked him when he played in Man City, but he did mess up a couple times. You needed a from Bar Mario Balotelli. You need an 84 rated team with 85 chemistry, one team of the weak player or foot champs player. So three Italians, three League One players. I didn't even like I wasn't even able to get my players that I had to sell actually some players might panic sell let's see if there's any Spanish players that I have because I know there's people that are trying to complete this as fast as possible and I might be able to panic sell at least one or two of these guys and like okay maybe not panic sell but like yeah, I don't know how I don't know how to actually call it 
like if I list him up, no, he's going for like nine something. No, it's not even worth it. Like if I have players that I could put them up for like, let's just say he's going for six thousand. If I put them up for four thousand, then some people would just buy them right off because they want to complete it as fast as possible. Now I do want to remind you guys that like right now, three minutes left. If you guys, if you guys start the SBC and don't go, don't don't back out of it. If you start the SBC, you have time to complete it, even if it says expired. You can still submit it. So that's that's something good from this. I don't know if it's a glitch or a bug or something, but it's something that I that I put to the test in a couple SBCs already, and they've actually worked. Let's go with the last player. Now this player, Manuel Akanji. He's a fast player. I will give you that one. He's fast. He has good stamina. He has okay stamina, okay? He's fast. His short passes and long passes are nice. His vision's okay. Um, what else? His marking, stand tackle, and slide tackle are nice. He could do better on interceptions and heading accuracy. Reactions are good. He has low balance. I guess this is an okay card. The only bad thing is that being from Switzerland, there's not many players that you can link them up with. And the good thing is he's from the Bundesliga. Uh, from Dortmund Borussia Dortmund but he was going for about a hundred thousand I'm not sure how much he's going for now let me take a look at Footbin he was going for about a hundred thousand also there is a sheet behind me I'm pretty sure you guys already noticed that there is a sheet behind me because I want to change it up. I want it to look clean, and I don't. I don't want it to have a mess back there. I don't want to have to move stuff just to clear it off for the videos. I rather just put a sheet, and that way you guys don't see my clothes or anything like that in the back. It just makes it look cleaner. If I'm able to make it look like a green screen type of thing, then I will. If not, I might have to go buy a green sheet if I ever get into the green screen type of stuff. But let's look into the SPC. Akanji is going for 95,000. Even now, there's a couple minutes left, and I could click this Akanji right now and go and do it. There's 40 seconds left. Now, if I wanted to, I could complete this. But it needs an 85 rated squad. 85 for a player that is an 82 rated. Now there's people saying that he might get an upgrade because of the uh, ratings refresh or the the winter upgrades. Now if his base card goes up, it could push this one up to like an 83, 84 rated card. Which would be nice, but still, I on I personally don't think it's worth it. I can't fit him into my team. I have nothing but Spanish players in the back. The only way I could fit him into my into my team is if I have an icon center back and a center defensive midfielder from the Bundesliga, which I do have a red in form. You need an 85 rated team, three players from the Bundesliga. So I'm pretty sure Marco Royce, now that I think about it, Marco Royce was probably going for a good amount. I don't know why I just didn't put Royce. But I'm pretty sure this Royce, just being from the Bundesliga, was going for a decent amount. Actually, not even. Look, it's twenty thousand, and I bought him. I bought him for cheap when he was fifty thousand, and he's just dirt cheap now. Like, not even worth selling. Look, two hundred games exact. Oh damn, seventy-two goals, forty assists. 
but he's been coming up as as a sub the majority of the time. Now let's look at the new SPCs since the time just ran out. I was barely able to review them. Let's take a look at the, the new SBCs. This SBC is currently, the, if you leave now, you will not be able to complete the challenge. See, that confirms it right there. The SBC you are currently doing has ended. If you leave now, you will not be able to complete the challenge. That just confirms what I said, that if you're still inside of it, you can complete it. So that that that's really good. Like, you could just... If you have one player and you have like two minutes, you have one player that you really want to get, go into it. And then just the only bad thing is that you have to buy players from here. You can't go back into the transfer market. You have to start buying the players from here if you need it. Hmm. Yes, I'm going to leave. So let's go back. Let's refresh the SBCs and see who EA have released for today. Hyun Ming Son is out. Everybody wanted this Hyun Ming Son. This this Son is gonna be everywhere. Everywhere. I know so many people that want this Hyun Ming Son. They made him an 86 rated player. Now, what's his rate? No, not 86 overall. 86 rated player and 86 overall. Three Premier League players, players from the same league, maximum six, team of the week, two, or ones to watch. Team overall rating 86, chemistry 75. Okay, so they lowered the chemistry, which is good. They lowered the chemistry. But he's a left mid. Mm, EA, why didn't you make him a striker? If he was a striker, he would be perfect for me because I could just take out I could take out Leroy Sané, put Sterling down on the left mid spot, on a left mid spot, and put Hyo Ming Son up. Actually, I could put Hyo Ming Son instead of Sané. All right, so the first player I'm going to review is Huming Son. Like I said, I already said everything that you needed, all the requirements. He's a five-star weak foot. Damn. You know what? I, this might actually be the one card I go for. 89 acceleration, 86 sprint speed, 87 attack positioning and finishing, 88 shot power, 90 long shots. Vision 83, 81 crossing, 82 short pass, 84 curve. Reactions, ball control, dribbling, and composure are all nice. 90 stamina, which is amazing. Agility 82. His balance is okay. He has bad head heading accuracy. But if I put him in the mid spot... I don't really need ac uh, hitting accuracy as much. All I need is for him to hit her, not to be accurate with it. This is a really good card. I'm actually surprised that EA released a really good card this time. Like, this is possibly the best card I've seen. And... But it's an 86 rated club. Now, I have the players to complete it. I have no doubt about that. I have players. I, I could just throw in untradables. I have, and then I, if anything, I could just sell a couple players and that I have that I could just buy others. Now, 86 are probably going to go up in price. 86 and 85s are possibly going to go up. I'm pretty certain. Now, I could put this Marco Royce. What am I doing? I could put this Marco Royce up at left mid. And then I could put... Now, the problem is going to be finding two team of the weeks that'll fit it
because finding two team of the weeks. See, I have this cheat shadow that I'm I'm okay with letting them go unless I find somebody else. Now I could just buy a Tony Crows. These guys are always a go-to for these. This one and Casemiro. And being 88 rated. Now, I could even throw in a Kalor Navas. And then... Let's see if stuff like this works. I'm just gonna throw in random players, see if the rating works. Let me throw in an 86. Now I could sell that Socrates. I could sell that Socrates and get a couple players for that I need with that coins with those coins now an 83 here works does an 82 work yes it does does an 81 work it does 80 whoa okay that's f now all I would need is players with this rating but I need them Can a 76 ho oh, ho okay Okay, might be because of the 87, the, 80, the 90, and the 88. I have two 87s, 190, 188. This might be a little bit too much, actually. Let me try. Since 76 worked, let me try with a 81. And let me lower somebody. Let me lower this to an 84. And let's see if I could lower this one. Can't lower it to an 83 or an 84. Mm. But okay, if a 76 worked, that means I could throw this guy in there and make this one an 86. No. Oh, okay. My striker is 81. I would have to put my striker back. Back at a higher card. But which one? Does an 86 work? Or an 85? Actually, let me let me try with an 85. I have Slatan Ibrahimovic. I purchased four. 85 works now all I need is to get Premier League players from those for those ratings and I have two team of the weeks already right there I'm okay with letting that Chucky Lozano go because I have the 85 rated Chucky Lozano and having these two team of the weeks is gonna drop the price massively So if I go How much does this Socrates go for? It goes for about 40,000. Okay, so I might end up doing the video today. I'm going to go actually I will do a video. I'm going to get this on. I'm going to I'm going to get it. Marcel Sarachi, I don't want to take too long. I bet I believe this is a 20 minute video already. Marcel Sarachi. 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 Left back. You know what? This is a pretty decent card. And he's. Bundesliga. Now, this guy would link up with the other guy. 94 freaking pace? Whoa, I just saw that. 
you can add a chemistry style that doesn't even need to boost pace. You can add the defending, defending and passing or defending and dribbling. And you have a really good card, honestly. What do you need for this guy? You know what? I might end up going for him because there's not that many good left backs nowadays. Now the only problem is... Team of the week of foot champs players, 1. Bundesliga players, minimum 3. 84 rated players from the same nation, maximum 2. 80 chemistry. This is actually a decent card. And you can link them up with Godin. Actually, I could go for a Godin. You can link up and put a Jimenez. Seventy shots. He has better shooting than Casemiro, and he's left back. Eighty-five crossing, so you could you could just take him all the way up, cross with him, and you should be good. Yeah, if you boost up his his defending and his passing, you're set. I might end up doing these too. I really will. Now, Rigoni, right midfielder from the Italian league, Emiliano Rigoni. 94 pace, 79 shooting, 80 passing, 83 dribbling, 49 defending, and 65 physical. 65 physical makes me think, nope, 85 stamina. Okay, so they boosted up the stamina on all three. I believe all three. Yeah, they boosted up the stamina, which was a big issue on the other two, the other couple days. His acceleration is amazing. His sprint speed as well. 82 long shots, 81 attack positioning, 84 free kick accuracy, crossing 81. Argentina. These are actually all good good cards. This is a good sub. This is a really good sub. And we don't have that many ripe midfielders. 84 rated team. Argentina players 1. Serie A team players minimum 2. Maximum players from the same nation 4. Chemistry 90. Do I have any high rated Argentina players? Or... Let's go Serie A. Now you don't need Team of the Weeks for these guys. for the At least not for this one. So that's a plus. I think I'll, I'm finally going to end up doing... these SPCs and I'm gonna end up possibly doing all three let's go with let's check Argentina who do I have I have Banega Salvio Piatti now I don't want to turn in Piatti because I'm gonna do that well I'm gonna try and do the MLS challenge You need one Argentina player. That's that's good right there. Now, the only thing is that if I do Hyun Ming Son, I need to know who I still have left to submit. Why is it taking forever? I might be able to complete these for actually quite cheap and if anything I have I have somebody I could sell I know I I could sell this Kalu although I'm not sure if you're gonna need a screamer card in any of the SBCs that'll come up in the f in the near future I don't really want to sell this Chucky Lozano I just want to check the price how much he's going for now what's going on is everybody in here because of human so on I think this problems servers are slowing down 
That Hyo Ming Son looks like a really nice card, though. He's, he's going to be the first one I go for. I'm going to go for Hyo Ming Son, and then I'm going to go 60k still. I'm going to go for Hyo Ming Son, and then I'm going to go over to Sarachi. For an 81 rated card, he has really good. He has nice stats. I like his pace a lot. Now, how would I fit him into the club? Because, okay, so how would I fit him? That's the club that I'm going to, well, try and get the MLS players with. I might just go buy a Vela or something. Uh, you know what? I might not need that left back. Because then I'm going to have to make so many changes. It would have to be gold, say, here. Q Ming Son up there, but then Sterling doesn't fit. Sterling, I need to fit Sterling in somehow. And the only way I could possibly fit him is going like that, having Hyo Ming Son up there because he hard links to Harry Kane. And Gotze would only link up to Kroos unless I put Delaney in. And that's what the club would look like. It would make Harry Kane still at eight chemistry. That Sterling would probably go up to like seven or eight after position modifying him to a left mid. Delaney would be at seven. Go to say at eight. And Kuros at 8. That might work. Human Son would be at 3. 3. Wait, how much? Okay. This is 82 chemistry. But how much? Actually. For a left back. Left forward, I mean. For a left forward human son, he goes up to 85 chemistry, so he only goes up 3. That means he's going to be at 6 chemistry. Mm. 6 after loyalty, 7. And that's with the manager, I believe. So he'll be at 7. And I think that's where I have. Unless I do that. He'll be at 7 down there. And Sterling can stay up. I think that's, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to swap him out for... Or Leroy. Alright, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to come back later on, make another video. This is way too long. This is already like half an hour. I'm going to go ahead, sell some players, buy some players, do the SBCs, and hopefully later on today, I come back. I know I've said it every single time, but I'll come back because these cards look amazing for me, at least the human zone. So I will come back and finish these off show you guys and I also want to talk about something else that I want to do that has to do with the Liga MX title and all that but for now that's it hit that like button subscribe if you haven't hit that notification button so you know when I go live when my also on my twitch I'll leave the link down in the description I am streaming the last of us I am gonna be streaming 
I just started it. It's barely two streams. I have, oh, I'm also streaming other stuff. But I'm also going to stream other stuff like Need for Speed or something. But yeah, that's going to be it for now. I'll see you guys later.